The footage and information showcased in this video is from Dairy Mountain Holstein Farm in Moncton, New Brunswick. The Vanderheide family has been operating the farm since 1998. It's a family farm that's run by Jens Vanderheijn and his father. Fall of 2014, we, uh, we started looking at uh, milking robots. Um, it was a lot of work for, uh, for all of us and uh, kind of intrigued by milking robots. Uh, weren't all that familiar with the Bilmatic at that time, but looked around a couple of farms and uh, we're really intrigued by the uh, from the rear attachment as we were milking in a parallel parlor as well. Um, so in the fall, we decided we we're going to go with uh, Bomatic. Started up February 2015, and uh, I haven't haven't looked back yet and enjoying enjoying the robot life. Biggest thing that you see is of course the uh, number of milkins before with the parlor twice a day. Now we're getting 2.8 to 3.2 milkins uh, a day. Uh, utter health, a lot better. Our somatic cell count's gone way down. Um, just cows are a lot, lot calmer in the, in the barn there too. Sometimes you've got trouble getting the cows up to, if you, if you need to move them around or breed them or uh, doing herd health and all that. So cows are just much more relaxed. Uh, the other thing there too with this robot there with the manual attachment uh, option there, it's nice and easy, especially uh, you've got a fresh heifer or fresh cow that uh, isn't quite comfortable in the robot yet and not standing still, you've got the option to manual attach her or um, if you think there's something wrong with the cow, just a checker, manual attach. In case of a breakdown there that uh, the arm can't move, you can still keep milking. Not fast, but at least you can still keep going. So We've seen uh, a little bit of software up upgrades uh, so far, which have made improvements for the robot, uh, being a little bit more efficient, a little smarter uh, arm movements. Uh, so yeah, and as far as the robot itself, um, of course, you're not going to have any any single piece of equipment that's never going to break down. Uh, just found with this robot, if there's any breakdowns, uh, support's been there for technical or you know new parts. Been great, uh, and just the ease of repairing the robot if there's any issues. Um, it's fairly simple. Uh, looking forward to uh, getting the upgrades on the robot here with the double grabber. Uh, Hoping to see uh, a lot more efficiency out of the robot. We're just quicker attached, um, better attachments. Jens is very excited to get the robot switched over from a single grabber with a laser to the double grabber with our new 3D camera. Once Dairy Mountain has their robot retrofitted, it will be able to run our current vision software and get all the increase in efficiency that that brings. Stay tuned for more exciting products and new technologies being developed by Bomatic Robotics.